During the last few months and weeks, we have witnessed a significant deterioration of the humanitarian situation uh, in the northeast of uh, Nigeria uh, due to the increased violence. Uh, thousands of people have been forced to uh, flee their homes and to look for refuge in safe havens, uh, notably in Maiduguri and Yola uh, and other regions in Nigeria. Uh, thousands have also crossed the border into neighboring Cameroon, Chad and Niger. People who have fled uh, have lost almost all their belongings and need basic items. Uh, some of them have also lost contacts with their family or with their children. Others have been caught up in fighting or in bomb blasts and need urgent medical uh, assistance and the medical facilities either are not working or are uh, completely overstretched. In the last few months and weeks, for example, we have assisted 50,000 IDPs in Maiduguri uh, with food and non-food uh, items, uh, 12,500 IDPs in Yola in Adamawa State uh, with the same assistance and 5,000 in Kano. This program goes along with the Nigerian Red Cross Society uh, and uh, includes also uh, assistance such as uh, shelter, water, sanitation and uh, health assistance. We also are looking now into the, the issue of separated family members, notably the unaccompanied minor, where we have started to register them and uh, try to find uh, their, uh, their families. For the wounded uh, and sick, we have uh, a full surgical medical team here available, uh, which can assist in any uh, place in Nigeria to uh, help directly the hospitals to operate. And we have quite a significant stock of medical supplies so that we can give uh, donations to uh, health facilities. Uh, we also work together with the National Society, the Nigerian Red Cross, in order to boost their capacity to respond to uh, the needs. The first one is, uh, especially in the northeast of, of Nigeria, is, is access uh, to certain areas, uh, the rural areas, uh, we, we don't really have access. Um, and we are working on that one, so we have to concentrate on where uh, the people uh, uh, come to the safe havens. Others are the, just the sheer uh, dimension of, 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 of the assistance needed. Uh, we do our best, we increase our capacity, but the needs are enormous and we really have to concentrate on the most vulnerable ones. We also increase uh, our uh, assistance in neighboring countries, so not only in Nigeria, but uh, it's, it's now a regional dimension uh, where we coordinate with our uh, neighboring delegations to give the best possible assistance to these people.